Hello, and welcome to another ADLC digital lesson. Today, our lesson is on ink analysis. These signatures are made with different pens. There are times in forensic analysis where it may be useful to match an ink to a particular type of pen. Thankfully, the process of chromatography can help us with ink analysis. To do this chromatography experiment, you will need a selection of different brands of water washable markers. You'll also need paper towel or a coffee filter, scissors, a glass, water, tape, and a pencil. Your first step is to create a long strip two centimeters wide out of the coffee filter. Do this by cutting it open, folding it flat, and then cutting as long a rectangle two centimeters wide as you can get. When you're done, you should have a nice long strip. The next step is to prepare your strip for chromatography by making a mark five centimeters from the end of the strip. If you like, you can prepare multiple strips at the same time. In this case, we've prepared three strips, one each for three different brands of marker. We're going to do ink analysis on each one of these and compare them. The next step is to attach the strip to a pencil. The pencil will be used to hang the strip inside the glass. The bottom of the strip needs to be close to but not touching the bottom of the glass. If necessary, roll the pencil to adjust the length of the strip. You can add the water before or after you have placed the strip in the glass. Just make sure the water is only touching the strip below where you made the mark. Now it is time to observe the results. The idea behind chromatography is that the water carries the ink as it moves up the strip. But some parts of the ink, being heavier than others, are left behind on the strip in different places, producing a pattern. Since each type of ink is made differently, each ink will produce a unique pattern on the strip. For example, you may see different colors separate out, and you may see those colors on the strip in different places. The great thing about chromatography is that an ink will always produce the same pattern. So you can use this pattern to identify ink samples in the future.